If you're asked to figure out which one of these fractions here is greater, 3 eighths or 4 ninths, here's how you do it. So we could just divide 3 by 8 on a calculator, 4 by 9 on a calculator, and compare the decimals. That would work. The other way is to find a common denominator here for these two fractions. And if I took 8 and multiplied it by 9, and then multiplied 9 by 8, that would give me a common factor. 9 times 8, that equals 72. And 8 times 9, that equals 72 as well. So now we have this common denominator here. All we have to do is find the numerator, just compare them. Since we multiplied the denominator by 9 here, we need to multiply the numerator by 9 as well. That's because 9 over 9, it's just 1. So we're multiplying by 1. We don't change the quantity, just the way it's written. 3 times 9, that's 27. Down here, we multiplied 9 times 8. So let's multiply 4 by 8. 4 times 8 is 32. And now we have the same denominator. And because of that, we can just compare the numerators. And you can see that 32 is larger than 27. So 32 70 seconds, that's larger than 27 70 seconds by 5 70 seconds. So not a lot. It also means that 4 ninths, that's going to be greater than 3 eighths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.